What's up everyone, it's Trainer Dell, and in this video I have a true Draco deck profile. Now, I was like putting together the deck slowly for the past, I don't know, like two, three weeks. And then they came out with that World Championship um, Forbidden and Limited list. And I was like, right now my deck basically fits uh, the ban list. Uh, so this is a what I would run if I was going to the World Championship. So it's, I'm not, I, I I barely even play in, in local tournaments. I barely even play in big tournaments or anything. I'm really casual nowadays, but um, True Dracos went down in price and I was like, oh, might as well pick some up. So yeah, this is how I would uh, run it. Funny just that I had the cards for it. So the one masterpiece, because it's the boss monster and in the OCG it's at one. So I only picked the one because I was like iffy, like, oh, if we have a ban list, maybe I shouldn't pick up multiple copies, but it does what it does. One Majesty Maiden, the true Draco waifu, or caster, if you want to say. Um, she's the one that like you can add when a uh, monster, true Draco or true king monster from your deck to hand if your opponent activates a, an effect. Just one of. I was thinking two, but you know what, true Draco is like, you can't really do that. And that um, cricket is annoying. Two of the Ignis Heat, the true Draco warrior. Uh, saw some deck profiles that they weren't even using one, or they would use one, or not even any. And this was my favorite one for a while until I, I picked the masterpiece. I was running like a build with no masterpiece, like a true budget version. And. Him and the dynamite, they were they were so cool. So this is really good. They use spells and two. Uh, two is a really good number for me. I was using two before, still using two, even though I got a masterpiece. Um, let's go with the three dynamite knight, the true Draco fighter. He's he's awesome. He's 25, one tribute. Super beat stick and and searches traps when your opponent activates effect. So he does a lot of the combo pieces. One maxi because it's maxi and, and draw. The zoo is still in the TCG. Ghost ogre, it's no rabbit because yeah, zoo is still in the TCG. So my, I was playing this to go up against my friend, who uh, just a few of my friends I played. I mean yeah, zoos hit terribly in the OCG, but here in the TCG not so bad. So. That's why, that's my monster lineup. I can move this to the center. For spells, definitely gotta go triple True Draco Heritage, draw. Triple Disciples, draw. <laughs> one Dragonic, uh, Dragonic Diagram, just got the one. Like I was running, you'll see, you'll see Domain, I was running like Trip do Domain and I didn't have this, but having this, Oh my goodness, like, yeah, if you guys are playing the budget version, I, I commend you. I was, like, sticking to the budget version of True Dracos, but this is a game changer. This just makes it a lot better. Even, out, just, even if you just have one, and in the OCG, it's at one, so I don't feel so bad. Um, we'll see what the ban list does. It's as I'm filming this. Link summoning is legal here for the TCG. So, yeah. Oh, Draconic Diagram, so good. Then, yeah, Domain. Two Terraformings to search. We got the pot of dualities for drawing just to get some resources from the deck dig out stuff i need card of demise just two of them now i only got two because i could only afford two at the time i didn't want to get the third one and then checking that list out i found out that in the ocg they only have two card of demise so it worked out perfectly for me one monarch stormforth and a dark hole I mean, would work out perfect for me if I went to Worlds, which everyone going, best of luck. I hope America takes it. <laughs> True King's Return, starting off with the trap lineup. Gotta have it. You guys know what these do. True Draco Apocalypse, which sometimes I like more than that, honestly. Two Waterfall of Dragon Souls for just trying to search out or even like recycle stuff from hand. Two of the Monarchs erupt because I like the Stalos. I was going to build some weird the Stalos burn deck or something. I don't know. And then I saw um, a few deck profiles like from Sam and I 
just other ones showing this uh, deck and they were running this card and I thought, oh, that's smart too. Ever so often, I wanna chain this card, Skill Drain, when my opponent does something, but I need to chain one of those effects first. So I'm like, oh, but that one comes in handy. But this does also comes in handy, I like Skill Drain. Imperial Order, which I seem to draw a lot in this deck. I don't know how it's a one of, I don't search it. I just hard draw it so many times and I love it. And the Solemn Warning to get everything. So that's the deck. No real need for a, uh, an extra deck. The side deck, eh, I'm not really going to Worlds. I'm not really competing with this. I'm just still building it up. Um, I'm going to wait for the next ban list to see if I should invest in another one of these, another one of these, another one of these. I'll see how the next ban list hits and what I should do. So yeah, if anything's not right from the world's uh, ban list, let me know. I'm pretty sure I'm okay, but you know, we're, I'm human, we all make mistakes. So yeah, let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. Thanks for watching, peace.